Hello YouTube, back to another episode of the Kaito Files DLC, last episode. We know more about Mikiko, and now about her son, which we kinda got. Kaito got this Mikiko pregnant, I guess? And now we're trying to find her, with June's help. And hopefully, it comes out clean, I guess. I'm still wondering if there's really any side cases in this game. Which I haven't seen yet. There's a cat. Where? Hmm. The hell is it? Quiet now. Where is it? Are you behind here? Where the hell is this cat? My right ear. Where's it coming from? My right ear. Got it. Is it in the car? No. Where the heck's it coming from? Yeah, where the hell is it coming from? I don't see it. <laughs> Fuck. Is this it? What smell? Yo, you got food on you? Yeah, got some for you too. Sweet. Don't mind if I do. We got a pizza bun, Pog. Hmm. Okay, seriously, where the hell is this cat? Oh, it's right where here. Are we here. Well, I'm just stupid. Well, I'm just actually stupid. Oh well. Moshi, Moshi. Combat, but I do think, yeah. Where is it coming from? Is this it? Mother Crest. How much crest do we really need to get more? Uh, four more. Guess we gotta find four more. Hopefully. Come. By the way, Kaito, I've been curious. How does one join the Yakuza anyway? Say what? Maybe I want to find my family. So I thought I'd ask the expert. Oh, nah. Is it just like they do in the movies? Where you swear an oath to your boss over a cup of sake? Chu, please don't tell me you're serious. Yeah, and what if I am? Then you're even dumber than I thought. 
No kid should even think of wanting that life. Well, I'm not a kid anymore. Oh, really? Yeah, really. Okay. Then say goodbye to having your own bank account. Or a place under your own name. Any Yakuza you see is probably dead broke. That's how bad the police have them now. Trust me when I tell you. Give it up. Mm, not sure I buy all that. You've been out of the game for a while, oh, right? For fuck's sakes. How much wax do you have in those ears? Ha! Found you, little bastard! Huh? I knew I'd track your skinny ass down! You a friend of yours? Who are those guys? Oh, this asshole? I caught him beating on a homeless guy, so I figured he needed a lesson in empathy. Didn't last long when I twisted his arm, though. Uh, you just love getting into shit, don't you? Great. Listen up, shit stain. <laughs> it's time I got some payback. What, you want round two? This time I'm breaking bones. And I'm chopping limbs. Get ready to bleed. <gasps> Seriously? June, allow me. Oh. Hey, you with me? Uh, Are you really uh what is the deal with you? Seriously. You gotta keep passing out again. Man, unless you wanna get hurt! Let's just take his ass down already! This kid really knows how to choose him. Alright, fine then. Oh, these guys are tough. Wow, these guys are strong, and I'm taking damage over time. Jesus, these guys are strong. Jesus, these guys are fucking strong. I'm about to die. Yeah, we're gonna need some upgrades. These guys just hair hurt. June, you okay? Uh, wait, don't tell me I. Yep. Passed out again? Yeah, you sure did. You wanna tell me what's up with that? just can't handle that shit. What shit? Knives, man. When I see one, my brain just shuts down. The hell? You got some sort of knife of phobia going Maybe on? Maybe some trauma? Tell me you got stuck at some point. Not exactly. See, I was messing around with my dad's knife collection one day. And like a dad, he warned me never to touch them. But, as a kid, of course, I was gonna. Okay. Well, as you can guess, my dad walked in on me. And man, was he pissed. Which naturally got me pissed, so I started talking back. That's when he put the knife to my arm. You saying he cut you? A little. Enough to draw blood, anyway. I see. You get it now, June? Oh my god. Knives were made to hurt. A person the can fuck? die. If they're not careful around. Why would you do that to your own I don't son? Want you touching these ever again. Understand? So that's what did you mean? Yeah. If you ask me, he took his lesson way too far. He should have cut himself for yeah, that no matter. No shit. I has no fucking clue how to be a dad. Well, he does his work himself sick in his office. Though, he did apologize later. After he found out how bad he messed with me. Said he was out of line. No kidding. Hey, you think the Yakuza would still take me even with the fear of knives? If you pass out the moment you see a blade, 
I don't think you'd last long either way. <sighs> yeah, you're right. Fainting on the job in that line of work's a death sentence. Besides, it's not like you can always swoop in and save the day. I gotta get over this bullshit. Well, you can save the pity party for later. We're out to find your mom, remember? Right. Yeah. Anyway, after we were so rudely interrupted by knife people. Right. Hell is that? What smell coming from? Is it really? Oh, I see it. Huh? Where's it coming comes. from? Is there another cat that I'm not aware of? Oh my god. Alright, where's the cat? It's right next to me. Oh my god. I'm gonna I'm picking something up. Fuck's the cat? Oh there you are. Why are we here? We have enough? I hope we have enough. Two more. And also, I am kinda worried right now. That we need, like, some kind of food. Yeah, I don't want to keep dying so much. Hey there, Momoko-chan. Kaito-san. Gosh, it's been ages. Oh, who is this young man? His son. The name's June. Really? Oh my goodness, Kaito-san. When did you? Uh, don't we don't talk about him. that. He's actually, uh, it's kind of complicated. So Mikiko-chan might be alive? You're sure? Well, we're not, but apparently a lady who looked just like her was spotted in town. I came here hoping you might know what that's about. After all, you two were pretty much inseparable. Before she disappeared, did she reach out to you at all? Hmm. I can't really say she did. All I remember is she never forgave herself for what happened to Maho-chan. Wait. What happened to Maho-chan? Oh no. You haven't heard? I think it was... 13, 14 years ago? Anyway, it was tragic. Without even seeing it coming, Maho-chan passed away. You, you're kidding. What happened to her? Oh, Maho-chan. How'd it happen? Well, according to the reports, it was arson. Imagine your last moments being trapped in a fire. Arson. Arson. God, what a way to go. Their foster parents died that night, too. Why these horrible things happen, I'll never know. Mikiko-chan took it especially hard. <laughs> of course she would. Her sister was really all she had left. <sighs> After that, Mikiko-chan changed. It's like all the sadness in her heart evaporated from that point on. She'd say things like she'd kill the bastard who did it, as if the only thing driving her was anger. Will they ever catch the guy who did it? They did. Apparently it was a stalker who'd been after Maho-chan a while. He hung himself immediately after. Bastard just did himself in, huh? But Mikiko really hated that. Yeah. Mikiko-chan got so depressed. <laughs> It was hard to watch. 
Not only did she lose her little sister, she lost the people who took her in. Even though they weren't flesh and blood, they may as well have been her real parents. And all that goes away in a night. <sighs> to someone she can't even hold responsible. <sighs> June, did you know this? Well, kinda. It happened right after I was born, though, so I never heard much details. Damn. God damn. <sighs> you okay, Kaito? But why, yeah. though? Why did she Fine. have to die? We've got a job to do, don't we? Right. Where else in town might Mom have gone? <sighs> hey, what about your special spot? Have you checked there yet? Huh? What special spot? Special spot? <laughs> Seriously? I'm talking about Kamuro Theater. Mikiko-chan told me all about it way back when. Although, wasn't it called something else back then? Oh. Hey, uh, what was this special spot of theirs? Hmm. It's where Kaito-san asked your mom to go steady. Oh. <laughs> For real? For real? <laughs> mm-hmm. If I remember right, he took her to a movie, then confessed at the downstairs cafe. Uh, yeah. Uh, anyway, the place has been remodeled since then. The cafe's not even there anymore. But isn't the place itself still important? Those memories will always be there. I mean, maybe, but would Mikiko even go there after all these years? She might have if she came all the way back to Kamurocho. After all, she described it as one of the happiest times in her life. Huh. Did she really? Really? Well, it's not like we have any other leads. Might be worth a shot to check. Maybe. Yeah. I suppose we could. Maybe. Well... All right, at least the thing is, we're gonna need to get some items. Firepower. Yeah, if there's one thing I'm really worried about is the fact that I really need items at this rate. Hey! Slow down! So we need so we really need to figure out a way to find to get some more I and more money. Second, Can we do this. Can we microwave this guy? Oh, nah. I thought we can. To leave. No. I just I just wanna buy stuff, you know. Dang it. Alright, we're gonna need to figure out a way to buy stuff. Finding Uh <sighs> how sad.
Anyway. I'm gonna boost some more HP at least. Just to help us even further. There's a cat? Where? Oh, it's right here. Uh, I have to approach it. Is this it? Uh, that was uh, another thing, but I guess not. We shop, please? Alright, fine. Alright, we're gonna need some stuff, unfortunately. Just to keep ourselves alive. Maybe get like a few bentos. Nah, don't get sushi sets. Taiyaki? Interesting. Sake? More onigiri? And Odin? Yeah. I well, only spent like a little, but at least it's good enough for me, I guess. Alright, let's see here. Can we find some more stuff? Using the search mode? <laughs> Just give me, just give me a freaking. All right, finding. All right, we got some gear. Let's give you. Oh wait. I guess we could set these things now. Binding. Inner bottom skateboard. Defense duration twenty percent. Ex. That's pretty nice. Alright. Accessories. Hey! Slow down! I'm curious, is there a cat in here? Anything to look out for? No? Hmm. Guess not. Guess not. Whoa! We'll see. Alright, let's check for more stuff. Cause I know something was highlighted over here. <laughs> yeah, right over here. Something stinks. Long drill on the beach. <laughs> no, it's that song. If you remember the Yagi Me school stories of the dancing. Very curious how long Kaito Files is gonna last. Hopefully, it's gonna be a last a while. Alright, let's just head to the destination. Hmm? This right here. Alright, we need one more and we should be good. Eh? 
just... Oh, now we're getting tougher enemies, at least. These guys are tough as heck. Yeah, these guys are fucking tough. Jesus. All right, we need to find a place to eat. Got a little workout in at least. Yeah, let's go eat something. Yeah, these guys are pretty fucking strong. Hell is that? Blah blah blah. Oh no, it's just we can only get drunk. Dang it, we can only get drunk. I just need food in our system now. Wild burger. What? I'm starving. Now that was good. Delicious. I didn't think he eat too, but I guess that's fine. Is there a cat? Oh wait, smell? But oh, where? Where's the smell? Alright, where's the cat? We gotta find it, the cat. I hear it, but where? Hmm. Oh, it's right here. What have we here? Alright, I think we have enough. Gifted Brawler. Unfortunately, I don't know where the other 20 are, but at least we have some, I guess. Alright. Now that we got stuff, let's get some EX stuff. Like, full swing. Or even something like a a dodge roll. Press triangle near a gun. Interesting. Tank. Perfect iron guard. Iron break. Prime tackle. Wrestler throw. Iron Guard active. Oh. Alright. See if we can learn some techniques while we get to our destination. That hurts. That's annoying.
go picking fights you can't win. Not bad, old man. We going? <laughs> All right, let's see if there's more. There's some smell, but where? Where's it coming from? Yeah, that's what I want to know. Where is it coming from? That's the question. Hmm. Oh, right here. Is this it? Good. Not even human. Is that all he has to say? Anyways. Doubt she actually come in here, but... So, what's our move? Guess we head inside and ask around. Although it is a long shot, considering we're looking for a look-alike here. The odds of some random moviegoer knowing her don't sound too great to me. How do we go about this, then? Well, we gotta play it smart. Find someone who might have been here a month back. You really think we'll run into someone like that? Well, we're about to find out. That way, huh? Anyway, let's just get in now, I guess. Hey, you have a sec? I'm looking for the woman in this photo. Uh, who's that supposed to be? My mom. She's actually gone missing. Oh no, I'm so sorry. The thing is, she was seen here in town about a month ago. We wanted to know if she's dropped by. You recognize her? No, I can't say I do. I see. Oh, but I know somebody who might. Who? Our cleaning lady. She's been working here forever, and she's really good at remembering people's faces. Hey, that's some good news. Where can we find her? I saw her heading toward the roof not too long ago. Okay, the roof it is. Really appreciate the help. Roof. Irasaimase. Good. Delicious. Yeah, I'm so very surprised. I thought we'd get SP for eating food, but I guess not. Anyway. Well, no cleaning ladies I can see. Did we miss her already? Maybe she went somewhere else. Miki-chan! Come out, come out, wherever you are! Kaito, you hear that kid? She was calling for a Miki-chan just now. I highly doubt some little girl is out <laughs> calling your mom. Come on, we should at least ask. Not like we have any other bright ideas. All right. Miki-chan, where are you? Is it like a cat, dog, whatever? Uh, hi. 
Sorry to bother you, but did you just say Miki-chan right now? Yeah. She got separated from me. She your sister? No, my cat. Your cat? Oh, man. Hey, are you by yourself? You're not lost, are you? No, my brother's downstairs helping me look. The nice cleaning lady's helping too. Oh, the cleaning lady? You happen to know where she is right now? She said she'd look around the building next door. Next door would be the Millennium Tower, huh? Hey, Kaito, why don't we keep an eye out for her cat? Sure, no harm there. We'll let you know if we find her, little lady. Okay, thanks. Well, I guess we are looking for a cat. Find a cleaning lady. Guess we're going down? We're going here? Whatever. I guess our only choice is to go down, I guess. It's near over there. Alright, let's go over there. Sneeze, sorry guys. Alright, let's go, Kaito. Anyways, I think it's inside that we have to go. <sighs> oh, there's the cleaning lady. Maybe she's been around logging up. Maybe she'd see Mikiko. Uh, uh, Ma'am, uh, can I bother you for a moment? Hmm? May I help you? Well, I hear oh, a cat. goodness, that must be Miki-chan. Now, how'd she get up there? Ah, right. Uh, Miki-chan's that lost cat, huh? Oh, are you also out searching for the little deer? Uh, perhaps we can work together. Well... Sure, but I'm actually here for another reason. I need to ask you some questions. <laughs> then they'll have to wait till afterward. The kitty comes first, understand? We might as well help out, Kaito, seeing as we're already here and all. Yeah, you well... got a point. Seems like we won't get far otherwise. Problem is, how do we catch it? Could we lure it down to our level somehow? Well... Hey, June. Any idea how to get that cat down? Hmm. Maybe we could grab her attention with a toy. Even a ball might work. Cats love chasing things, right? Yeah. Not to mention being chased. I wonder would it work right now? Uh, Ma'am, can I bother you for a moment? We're looking for this lady here. Oh. That poor dear. Huh? A little girl lost her cat around here, and she's been worried sick. What if Miki-chan gets hit by a car, she says. Oh, I'd just as soon not see that happen. Oh, I see. Seems like these ladies really fixate on that cat. Well, what the hell are we gonna do about that cat? Hmm. What are we gonna do about that cat? Oh. Can we use the drone? Hey, 
I think she likes it. I forgot we had a drone. <laughs> we did it, Kaito! Nice one! Oh, Miki-chan! Okay, now to get back to the cleaning lady. Alright. Ma'am, would it be alright to ask you a question? Certainly. What can I do for you? I'm Kaito, from the Yagami Detective Agency. We're looking for the woman in the picture. My, what a sweetheart. Who is she? She's my mom, who's been missing. Missing? Oh my, that's awful. Thing is, she may have been sighted here in town not long ago. She has a bit of history with Kamuro Theater, so we were thinking she might have stopped by. And since you work here and all, we were wondering if you've seen her. Oh, I've been working here about four years now. But I can't say I've seen her around. Damn. Although, now that I think on it... Huh? What is it, miss? You get an Something answer? Good? Oh, I remember. It was that picture. The same? Yes. This was nearly two years ago. A, a man was going around with a picture asking if the woman in it had been found. What you're doing right now reminded me. Really? A man was looking for her two years ago? A year why? and a half, to be precise. It seemed serious. Wait a minute. Mom disappeared two years ago. If someone went looking for her half a year later... Oh. Wait, what does that mean? Someone's out for her. Could you describe this man you saw? What exactly did he ask you? Hmm. It has been a while since we spoke. But you know... What is it? He did give me his contact information, in case I learned anything Hog. relevant about the situation. Really? Do you still have his information? I do believe so. Now, where could it be? Uh, I imagine it's tucked away in a drawer back home. If you have it, would you mind sharing that with us? We'll even pay if need be, and wait till you're off the clock, of course. Here, my number. That ought to do. Ooh, Pog. Wonderful. It won't be long until I'm off, so I'll look for that info the moment I get home. That'd be great. Thanks so much. Oh, hope it helps reunite you with your mother, kiddo. I right, talk to you soon. Finally, we might get somewhere in this case. And with that, we head back to the office. Okay. Well. Oh hey. If it isn't that oh, Bonzo, no. it's shit for brains. It's those Kaito. fuckers. Wait. What's that kid with you? June here is my client. What do you care? Do you acquaint it or something? Kidnappers, Kaito. Or at the very least stalkers. Are they now? Yeah. They've been following me around since yesterday. I bet they know my dad's loaded and want me for the ransom. They say shit like, we're decent people, just come with us. We'll <laughs> even buy you some video games. Aww. Bunch of creepy old geezers, and he's their head idiot. Hey, watch your mouth. I think he's not this a guy, head idiot. This That's kid's right. got a big mouth. You're the head idiot here. Can you two shut your pie holes? <laughs> You're not making us look any smarter. First blackmail. Now kidnap me. They're a crime you won't do. Makes me sick to think you call yourselves detectives. I ain't here for a lecture. Just give us the gate, or you're in for a world of hurt. Oh? You're not laying a hand on my client. You want him? You have to go through me. Oh, you are such a goddamn pest, you know that? Boys, exterminate this asshole! Let's do it then. Get me! <laughs>
Is he gonna guard just like that? Which I'm gonna break his guard. Damn, we're not doing as much damage as we thought. Oh, come on, we didn't even dodge that. Alright, we may have to boost our attack. Oh! Damn, we do need more abilities, unfortunately. You really thought you'd get away with nabbing a kid his age? Worth a try. Everyone oh, what the cool fuck? And nobody gets hurt. <sighs> the classic misdirect. Oh, come on. God damn it. Low blow. Goddamn bite till shitheads. Doubt they went back to their HQ. But I should still check there just in case. Fuck me, man. Now we're deep into more shit now. I'm ah, delicious. Arigato. Jesus, of all the times to be in danger, it had to be why. Uh, nothing we could really do about it, but accept it, you know? No! What? This guy. This guy. Head to inside. I'm ready. I'm gonna save just in case. Of course, it's empty. They must have relocated Where somewhere else. 
What's with all the boxes? Are you in the middle of skipping out of here? Could be worried about getting busted. Hope I could figure out where they're moving. We left a clue rallying around. Something with their new ad address. Ah. New brand of cigarettes. Is this it? Huh? More sniffing stuff. Hmm. The important thing is, can we hear anything? Or see something? This right here. Backing tape? Probably for the rest of the boxes. Ubers must have left it here. Hmm. Curious what's behind this door. Mm. But yeah, we still gotta look for the address. What's this? Is this important? Is this it? Guess not they're taking the phone. Not much help to me anyway. Too bad I can't call up a scumbag relocation hotline. Maybe ask for where these guys are going. right here. What's this? Moving box, huh? Could be something interesting here. Huh? It can end up doing me some real good. Copy it down real quick. Is that it? I feel like there's, there's more. Right? Let's see. This. this right here. Sound on the floor. Some kind of note. What have we here? It's got numbers on it. Looks like it might be a phone number. What else are we missing? Huh. Zephyr for the for the for the moves. Time to give him a ring. Better use the often post phone just to be safe. Must be more believable. This right here. Whiteboard phone number. Huh? Put this phone here to work. I'll try calling that number I found. Number on the whiteboard. Let's see if anyone picks up. Hi, thanks for calling Kyushu number one star. That does look familiar. It's just Kyushu number one star. Add it to my contacts, so I haven't had to doubt uh, that actual number for in a while. Sorry, wrong number. Next time I'll call with an order, okay? Mr. Regular's here to air too. Can't blame him. The prices are good, noodles aren't half bad. Anyway, this one's a bust. Let's keep looking. A little more in the moving box. Call that number I just found. Maybe I can get some info from the movers. Hello, and thank you for your business. Oh, for fuck's this sakes. This is the Bato Detective Agency, yes? How can I help you today? Oh, uh, see, I actually lost the address to our new place. Though people say I have the memory of a goldfish, so... <laughs> gotcha. No worries. Happens all the time. Let me go ahead and pull up your info. Yeah, that'd be great. Let's see. It says here it's on Senrio Avenue. As for the building number, one moment. So we got an address. Nice, that sure worked out. 
I'm gonna crash your new digs on Sinrio Avenue. Nice. Very nice. Senrio Avenue is over all the way down there. Uh, and yeah, unfortunately, let's do one last battle. Alright guys, unfortunately, I guess this will have to be it for today. So yeah, next time on Yakuza or Lost Judgment, the Kaito Files. We're gonna go to Sinrio Avenue and see what that- see if we can save the kid from the damn bottle agent, whatever. See you guys all next time.